are here today because we recognize how heinous this act was. We do know that this was a horrific act and that we are looking to ensure that we get answers. Yes! It's very important. It's very important that we have an expedited, transparent, transparent investigation. And I, I and my colleagues um, have been on the phone, and I met, I just finished meeting with the police commissioner, as well as I've had conversations with the mayor's office, that we want an expedited, transparent investigation. And so I have been given assurances by the police commissioner that we will, in fact, be advised as the investigation goes on of at what stages they are and, and what's happening in the investigation. It will be transparent and it will be done in a timely manner. But we can't rush it because we want it to be thorough. We want the answers. So I'm asking you today that I want you to be patient. I want you to be patient while we go through this investigation. The police commissioner has said that a part of the process is that they are having internal affairs to start the investigation as well as the DA, the district attorney. And they will go through, they will determine the cause of death, and we will be given that information as they get it. I want to make sure that you all understand that the community and the council is here to support the family and to ensure that we get the answers that the family and the community deserve.